Vincenzo's Gold Crypto Investing and a quick update here. Let's look at, you can see some of the coins are moving a little bit. We'll start with XRP. It's, it's on the downtrend a little bit right now. Let's get back into here. You can see we're actually coming down again, looking like we might try to double tap down here into this uh, white traded area. That's a, a major trading area, right? And if we have our pointer tool out here, you can see we got a little price predicting uh, little forecast we did where it looks like we could be in where the last time we were in here, we came down, bounce on the support a few times, come up, get rejected by the moving averages, trade back down again, right? And dance along the lower support between the 77 and the 81 cent range. And then as we move over, this could be forming the right shoulder of as we zoom out, right? Could be forming the right shoulder of our head and shoulders topping reversal pattern, right? That's what we maybe have going on here in the old XRP. And we're gonna keep watching out for that now to see if over the next six or seven days, are we not in an up and down fashion where we crash 10, 12, 15%, pump 10, 12, 15%. Are we now in the next three to five days forming this right shoulder? And can we anticipate a pop back up here to upper resistance like we did before at 92 cents to form the peak of the right shoulder to really define it and then we trade back down to the neckline in white and then break the neckline and end up down here which just so happens to end up at our major uh dump bottom that we've been waiting to trade back down to at the 57 cent flash crash low and the head and shoulders topping reversal pattern from the top of the head to the bottom of the neckline at the white line to the point of the breakout gives you your targeted move of 59 cents and it makes sense that that would be a double bottom right so that's what we're watching out for there in the old xrp uh the bitcoin dominance nobody cares about bitcoin you can see it's trading back down just like we thought it would back down let's zoom out a little bit to the four hour time frame you can see it's traded back down we'll get rid of that because that was an old pointer tool and let's bring out our new pointer tool. You can see after it's traded back and sideways out and off of this major consolidation after the flush right here, we traded along this orange ring with every now and then popping north of it. Then we got up here on a nice little double top pump from right here. It's a fabulous glowing all jabroni enticing uh, double top, right? So it's a jabroni buy, a jabroni buy, just as jabroni buy, jabroni buy, right? And then here was a jabroni buy because there was a little double top in the middle. And we told you come back down to the $46,000, uh, 769 range along the orange ring again. And then if it fails it, it's coming down here. And the same similar thing XRP is doing on a double bottom from this flash crash. And then now this ring would act as upper resistance. And if you can't get past by there, you're going to flash down over the next few weeks to $32,248, right? So that's what we're watching out for. Uh, and the Bitcoin, that seems to be the most uh, probable solution as we start to trade down. And this, as we are in all these coins, to at least come back down and double bottom those flash crash wicks that we had a few weeks ago prior to the holiday pump, right? So that's what we're watching out for. We'll go over to some of these altcoins real quick. You can see Falcon again is getting beat down. This coin just cannot find any stability. It's trying to down here along that bottom of the 18 cent level that we were talking about with the volume trading we'll keep a close eye on that as we zoom into the hour time frame you can see it's working its way in the hour time frame to the 50-day moving average in red and that could act as bearish or it could just act as a consol bullish consolidation on it to move up to the next level which is blue right above that or the 100-day moving average so we're going to keep a close eye on this i know you're looking for a swing trade we're going over the numbers and we're going to try to get you some good swing trades as this one uh has been trending south but it's on some support so we'll keep it all updated uh you can see dent for jerome is trading south we knew to be out of that because in the three and four hour time frame it's below the 200 day moving average in green you can see in the two hours it's coming down for another tab at a bottom if you can't hold that we know our another uh big drop low down here at support is this green fib circle and this white horizontal from left to right white uh support line right about the same area at about the 0 0.0029 to 0 0.00312 69 would be your underneath support right where that little dot is like subscribe and share to vincenzo's gold crypto investing peace and love
Peace and